Hello everyone, my name is Jacob and today I should be building a hair air jump jet in Minecraft. Okay, so uh, probably a lot of you uh, is familiar with the hair air, uh, the so called jump jet. Uh, it is a very, very interesting airplane. Uh, it is one of the few successful VTOLs uh, in the world. Uh, especially in military service and uh, it is just a very cool plane it has a single engine uh, single jet engine which is mounted in the in the center sort of and uh, it has uh, sort of different ports for uh, for the um, the the air uh, to go out of uh, their sort of nozzles uh, that propel it in different directions and uh, it sort of uh, makes it so that it can take off uh, vertically and land as well uh, and uh, I have been always fascinated with uh, these planes and uh, that's why we are building one to okay so uh, I'm gonna be building this sort of uh, I think it's the British uh, Navy color uh, color scheme so uh, it, we have the, the white on the bottom and we have the sort of uh, gray on top uh, and uh, I think it looks pretty cool so let's go ahead and start building it so first of all uh, I'm gonna start with the landing gear now you can uh, see uh, right at the beginning that this plane has uh, quite interesting landing gear we have uh, sort of front and, uh, and rear uh, landing gear uh, legs uh, which are in the middle uh, and there they are in the in sort of in line and then you have some stabilizer uh, landing gear uh, on the wings on the ends of the wings uh, and uh, so you get this sort of shape uh, now the the landing gear on the wings would uh, fold uh, sort of uh, in the uh, horizontal configuration uh, to the back and uh, the the middle ones would just fold uh, into the uh, the fuselage uh, but anyway let's start with the middle ones uh, and then we're gonna add the uh, the side ones the the wing stabilizers uh, a bit later when we build the wings okay so uh, after I've done that, uh, I can continue with uh, basically the fuselage. Uh, so we're gonna start with the bottom part, and I'm just gonna use this uh, this clay. Uh, what is this? Uh, Cyan hardened clay. And uh, I'm gonna go three blocks uh, to the to the front from the landing gear, uh, and the the frontmost block is gonna be a black wool. That is also a part of the uh, Royal uh, Navy color scheme. Uh, normally, well, normally uh, in other color schemes, it would be just uh, sort of the color of the rest of the uh, fuselage. So anyway, uh, let's continue. Uh, I'm gonna just add a nice uh, long line of box uh, all the way to the to the back. And then we're gonna add other stuff to it. So, uh, as you've probably noticed on the sides uh, of the jet, there are uh, intakes, which are very um, sort of a defining feature of this plane. Uh, so, first of all, I'm gonna put down the cockpit uh, glass. Uh, it's gonna be right there. And then behind that, uh, we're gonna have a block of hard clay. Like so. And then behind that, I'm gonna have some stone slabs, uh, which are basically gonna go all the way uh, to the back. Uh, we're actually gonna remove those two, uh, and then uh, we're gonna add the side uh, intakes for the jet engine. Uh, so we're gonna start on this block here. So this is the second block of the cockpit uh, window. Uh, so we get this sort of effect of um, of sort of stairs. Uh, if you know what I mean and uh, on the bottom of that uh, we're gonna add another slab so one block lower uh, we're gonna have uh, slabs going 
but these are actually going to be in white um, because of the as I said before because of the color scheme so uh, in the middle of those we're gonna put down a furnace now in the real on the real plane uh, this would be a sort of a somewhat of a different shape uh, it would be a sort of a semicircular intake uh, running uh, sort of vertically not horizontally um, uh, to the uh, to the fuselage unfortunately I cannot really represent that uh, in Minecraft so this is just the path that I've chosen uh, so anyway let's continue I'm gonna go ahead and place down uh, a couple more blocks of uh, hardened clay here uh, and uh, do the same thing on the other side so we have three blocks here now uh, and then we're gonna go on uh, and uh, use some stone stairs stone brick stairs uh, and we're going to place those like so so that, that would be uh, three blocks I'm pretty sure or maybe more four blocks uh, so these are gonna sort of make our fuselage a bit uh, bulkier without um, adding full blocks if you know what I mean so this is pretty much um, how our fuselage is gonna look we're gonna add a couple of stuff to the bottom and uh, that's gonna look pretty much it so uh, on the bottom we're gonna continue with the uh, with the quartz stuff but uh, we're gonna uh, let's add uh, a couple of quartz slabs first of all and then we're gonna add uh, quartz stairs which are gonna be like so uh, so on the on the outside like that and uh, we're gonna need uh, some on the other side as well Now I'm trapped in here unfortunately, so I'm gonna have to release myself, uh, but that is not uh, a very big problem. So uh, we have sort of achieved this, this sort of look. Um, and uh, we can now continue uh, by adding uh, the rest of the fuselage. Okay, so uh, we are going to be continuing uh, at the at the rear of the plane uh, and we're gonna add uh, three slabs uh, three uh, quartz slabs to the to the back there like so and then on top we're gonna add a vertical stabilizer which is gonna be made of uh, hardened clay blocks uh, so something like that and we can also add a stair like so and a slab to the, to the top uh, before I forget I'm also going to add piece of cobblestone wall to the outside uh, sorry to the to the back here basically sort of there uh, and uh, that is pretty much it for our fuselage uh, let's add the horizontal stabilizers as well so those are gonna be uh, located right there and they're just gonna be simple three block ones uh, like so okay so uh, you can see here the the basically everything but the wings of the Harrier uh, and looks pretty cool so anyway uh, it is time to add the wings uh, so because the wings are in the Harrier uh, are sort of slanted downwards uh, I can't really rep uh, represent that uh, in in the game so I've decided to go for the sort of uh, staircase effect uh, and uh, I think it looks pretty good uh, hopefully you like it as well so anyway let's continue by adding uh, a row of slabs uh, on the top here on the top sides uh, and we're gonna go to this block here like so so we get this sort of flat surface on the top this is gonna be the start of our wings from there uh, we're gonna go down uh, we're gonna have a row of four blocks here like so uh, and then we're gonna have a row of three blocks there like that and uh, we're basically gonna go one block out here and then uh, we're gonna go down so like so so we're gonna have something like that and then um, then we're gonna have something like that uh, so we have this sort of smoother transition 
uh, from uh, I didn't screw that up actually. Uh, so we get a, a sort of smoother transition from uh, from sort of the stair staircase effect. Uh, anyway, so we have uh, we have these three blocks there. Uh, I'm trying to figure out where I screwed this up. Um, I'm not quite sure actually. No, oh. these are actually on the bottom here. Um, I think okay yeah and then we go out like that um, and back like so uh, and also apparently um, okay there we go so Okay, I need to add another row of blocks there. That's fine. Anyway, so we have four blocks here, and then we have three blocks, and then we go down like that. We delete the bottom ones, and uh, everyone's happy, and uh, that's pretty much it. So we go out like that as well, just to finish off the wing. Uh, we have this sort of weird shape that I've come up with. Um, but I think it looks good enough. So anyway, uh, this is our one wing. So let's build the one, the other one properly, uh, so we will be able to to know uh, how to do it. So let's go in this direction. Let's add four blocks, uh, four slabs, I should say, in a row here on the bottom block, on the bottom part of the block. Like so or on the top actually. Then we're gonna add another row of three slabs uh, right behind it, like so. Then we're gonna add one slab uh, to the top there. When we've done that, we can add the, start adding the bottom. So uh, we're gonna have a slab on the bottom side of the block right there, uh, and then the rest of the one, the, uh, the rest of the slabs are gonna be on the bottom. So we're gonna add one right there, uh, and we're gonna add uh, two so and we're gonna add one uh, two as well and the at the very back like so and we have this sort of shape of, for the wing uh, we I did build uh, a sort of a distinct bottom as well so the first slab comes in like so uh, just that's just because I wanted to avoid having the bottom sort of uh, crease uh, visible. So we have this sort of um, this sort of slab that that comes underneath the top one, uh, and it sort of feathers the whole thing. So anyway, this is our basic uh, area jet. I'm also going to add uh, the wing stabilizers. Uh, landing gear as I said before uh, these are going to be located on uh, this block here uh, this slab rather uh, you could uh, there they are uh, located uh, in different sort of um, spots on the wing uh, in the in the real place because there is quite a lot of variation between planes there are there are many different uh, sort of series of them. Uh, I have decided to sort of place them in the pretty much in the middle of the wing, uh, and uh, uh, I think it looks pretty good. So let's do uh, let's put uh, another one on the other side, and uh, let's take a look at this thing. So uh, I think that's pretty much it uh, for this plane. Uh, I had a little bit of uh, trouble building the wings. But yeah, you know, uh, what can you do? Uh, you cannot be uh, very smart if you're dumb. I don't know what that means, but anyway. Uh, thank you very much for watching, as always. Uh, if you like this video, you can press the like button and subscribe to my channel. You can also check out my other videos. And uh, I will see you next time.